Last time on Golden Sun. What? Yeah, of course we do. Probably. You know, we do. Yeah, sure. I'm like 8% sure we won't die. Well, if Zeno's going, then I guess I'm in too. Because Zeno's always the best decision maker. Hey guys, Raiden here, and welcome back to Golden Sun. So, I know it's been a little bit since the last episode. I've had some stuff I really needed to sort out that's still probably not entirely sorted out, but... No, leave me alone. It's a lie. By the way, I don't think you can fail to flee battles in this game. Aside from maybe, like, boss fights, I think it lets you jump out of any single battle you want to. Which is bad, because that's horribly tempting, and doesn't really enforce preparation when going into a dungeon, but at the same time, I guess it's kind of relaxing. That's something I've noticed this game does a lot, and that's like, a lot of conventions RPGs have, it just removes them for like, the sake of ease, but then at the same time, like, there's a bit of that sense of challenge, and uh, I'm not gonna say it's not challenging at all, but there's a little bit of a lack of preparation, I feel, that you need before entering a dungeon. Like, you start off right away and you have the, let's get out of the dungeon spell, which I don't mind. So between episodes, I did climb back down this tree and back up and heal everyone. I completely forgot I had the, uh, retreat spell, which gets me out of here. <laughs> and just basically back onto the world map, which is amazing. Um, I'm used to that being kind of an item, but they just give it to you here. And I did go back and I bought Ivan one of those artifact weapons called the Witch's Wand and it has Staff Unleashes Stun Voltage. I have no idea how to activate that, I'm assuming it's like, um, my sword, where it just kind of activates when I attack with it. Problem is, I don't really have Ivan swinging at things, but it raises his attack up, which is the big thing. So, probably lets spells do more damage, unsure. But that's actually one thing I really like about this game. And mind you, I haven't played Destiny since like, Destiny 1 and, like, early Destiny 2, because, like, I don't know, sometimes the game just kind of doesn't do it for me. But one thing I really love about Destiny is the exotic weapons. I think that's such a cool idea. And a lot of games, I just don't know why they don't do this, but a lot of games kind of gloss over special weapons. And they're like, oh, here you go, the weapon has high stats, and that's it. But things like Destiny in this game have weapons that have special modifiers attached to them. And I don't mean, like, can do fire damage or ice damage, some modifier like, oh, now you can do this special slash, or now you can cast this spell, and it's really cool because it makes the unique weapons of the game feel more unique instead of just stat ups that'll become irrelevant soon. Like, you'll always remember, oh, I love that weapon because it has a special attack on it. Oh my goodness. In my opinion, though, I do find the encounter rate to be a little high. <laughs> I'm gonna try and fight this thing again. And we're gonna try and do some damage, I'm gonna do this. Oh, I didn't mean to run, shit. <laughs> Sorry, I'm so used to, like, other RPGs where it's just, open the menu, ready to go, let's fight. <laughs> so we're just gonna unload on this guy. Fast as possible. Forge to increase attack, and granite, which increases defense. Whoa! Ooh, that hurt. But that defensive buff helped out a lot. And our attack raise, too. So let's summon... Ramses. Actually, we can probably do that on Ivan's turn, can't we? Yeah, in the meantime, I will cast... Spire. He will go for... Mars. And... You can go for Ramses. There we go. I probably should have healed, but... Eh. 96 damage, well worth it. I probably should have cast that, because that raised his earth damage. Yeah, I probably should have done that for myself, because I do have the earth gin equipped. Anyways. Oh, it's still recovering. All right then, in that case, we're gonna go with Spire. He is going to go with Volcano, and he is going to Plasma the hell? When did you learn that? <laughs> I don't remember you learning that spell. But anyways, I need you to heal me with the power of herbs. Spire. 
Oh, hey, I killed it. That's right, you're not getting away from me this time. Get inside of me. Breeze. Cool. So, he appears to be a water, uh, Ginny. By the way, you guys told me that, uh, Genie or Ginny is the plural for Jin. And I guess that's why they say it. Makes sense. So, we have Breeze, who... I'm trying to... Well, whatever. <laughs> uh, his effect is he can boost party resistance. Alright, well, let's continue our journey up the tree. This is the last room I got into that I don't really think I understood. Because the last thing you can do is jump on this breaking leaf. And that kind of screws you over, so... Perhaps I have to go a different way? Because I can't jump over to here. I also did pick up these items called Sacred Feathers, which are supposed to... Uh, decrease encounter rates, but they last, like, a minute. They are so not worth it at this level just because I don't have the money to go around buying all of it. From what I understand is I have to get down into that center hole in the tree by breaking these leaves in the correct order to ensure I can do that. But that requires stepping on that middle leaf twice, and I don't even know how I'd accomplish that. Oh, duh, I'm an idiot. How did I not just do this? And hopefully that works, and it did. I'm hoping that this is the correct way. Seems to be. Maybe. I don't see a way out, however. Oh, yep, there's a talking face. But... Hoom. <laughs> Hoom. You, you hope to find my kindly self? Fools. You should never have come here, and now you shall never leave. Your powers protected you in the forest, but now you are in the heart of my power. Here, you will all become trees, and you'll wither with the rest of us. Even Ivan? Yes, even Ivan. Oh my god, look at this dumb Nintendo boss. Tret appeared. Kind of reminds me like of an SMT theme, just the way it's all going down. So I can't use Ramses right now, because... Oh, I see. So I summon the power of wind. I don't remember what that does, but... Probably not worth it in my case. Let's use Flint. He is going to... Set forward, since I guess I didn't have it set. And he is going to cast Plasma, because I haven't casted that yet. Oh, by the way, you guys did tell me that there are uh, elemental hits. So if I see exclamation marks above an enemy's head, that means I am hitting their weakness. I'm assuming for the tree is fire. Uh-oh. Well, that's not that bad. Okay, now let's try this. Summon Ramses, because that's going to give me that boost in Earth. And for you, I want you to... Whoops, no. Summon Ramses. I want you to just... I don't know, Volcano. And as for you, try using Jupiter. Ooh, wind power. Glad I got Ramses though. If I got that one back where the uh, mayor lived, I could have gotten the double water summon too. 119, that's insanity. Ow, plants. Oh, yeah, I saw the exclamation marks down there. I got three. So, he is definitely weak to fire, as I kind of expected. <laughs> I would honestly be surprised if he was not. Oh, they're still recovering. Okay. Um, yeah, I'll just attack. You just keep casting those fire spells. Let's see, is Flare Wall going to do any more? And as for you... 
Let's go for Whirlwind. It's not doing too much. Oh yes, we got Rapid Smash. And I'm nimble, so I dodge the blow. Unlike my compatriot Ivan, who dies every other five seconds. So I got Weaken? An Earth Attack called Gaia. And Elude. I want to try Gaia. Uh, let's try Volcano again. And with you. I want to get Granite. Yeah, I want to get the buff from Granite. Sleep Star. Oh no! You put me to sleep. Yet I am still setting things. <laughs> That's weird. Well, that's fine. Uh, I do have an elixir. Elixir me. Use plasma. Oh, I guess he woke me up anyway, and that elixir was a waste of time. Do I have a party-wide heal? That would be nice to use. Right about now. Uh... No, I don't, but Ivan is not as strong as the rest of us, so... Heal yourself, Ivan. We'll keep doing the damage. He's putting us to sleep ag Oh, I'm asleep again! I just got up, too. Let's raise our attack. Um, I want you to heal. Yes. Okay, there we go. I'm still asleep, but not much I can do about that. Summon Mars. And as for you, let's... No Ramsey's quite yet. Oh, he's dead. He was actually just about as hard as the Jin I fought down on that tree branch. Ivan's now level 10 Windseer. He's the only one who leveled up, too. What has happened to me? You got kind of angry and grumpy. Was I... I see. My heart was all but lost in my rage. And you defeated the evil within me. Thank you, I could not leave this world with so much evil in my heart. What, you're still gonna die? I am free now to leave the world without regret. Goodbye, great warriors. Please repeat that into the microphone. I need to bring that back to the mayor. Hey, wait a minute. We can't let Tret die like this. That's right, Zeno. We still need his help. What? <laughs> I guess I can postpone dying for five seconds. Why have you not left me to my dying? Do you need something? Yes. I turn the people of Kalima into trees? <laughs> I love how he still says that. I must release them before they die with the forest. <laughs> I can't do it. My power no longer reaches Kalima. F people of Kalima, forgive me. So all this was for nothing? Tret's too weak. He doesn't even have the power to save Kalima. No, we have to heal him. Uh, I think his face just kind of shrunk into infinity, Ivan. Don't think there's any healing left to do. We can't let the people of Kalima die with the forest. Every life in Kalima depends on us. We have to restore Tret and save the people of Kalima. How? So, for those of you who also uh, have Wii U's, is your controller life, like, ridiculously short also? Or is it just mine? Because it feels like my controller, no matter how much I've charged it, just turns off every couple hours. Okay. 
Well... Oh, I just climbed right out the front. Um, are you okay, mister? Mind read! People of Kalima, forgive me. You're not very helpful. What about you, Lady Tree? Mind read! The healing waters of Mercury Lighthouse might save Tret. But the fountain's waters have dried- have long since dried up. Leave now before the forest is destroyed. Mercury Lighthouse? Where the hell is that? I don't remember. It, if I even saw it in the first place. Well, it's not here, so... You have to leave either way. The one thing I do dislike about it is that when I had to go back to town and I restocked and replenished everything, I had to come back through and solve every single puzzle again to get back to where I was. I don't really like that too much. Especially since I assume I'm gonna have to come back here again once I have this special holy water. Wait, there's a tower at the tip of Lemil that people say was built by the gods. Everyone there calls it the lighthouse. Well, where is it? Only great adepts can enter the lighthouse of Lamil. No, but where is it, though? Wait, you must be mad. It's almost winter and you're going to Lamil. I'm going to take that as an assumption that it is north. <laughs> and we are to head north after a nap. Because if I know anything in those fantasy worlds, for some reason they hardly ever change the fact that North is cold. <laughs> North we go. Mainly because I don't know where else to go. Aha, there is snow. Therefore, I must be correct. Oh, you know that cave I found before? I think that's how we get up there. All right, well, we're back in Billabin Cave. Let's hope I chose the correct direction. Because the enemies in here weren't that difficult. So I can only assume that it's okay that we go this way. Oh, little ice rocks. Are they pushables? They are not. But there are still annoying goblins everywhere. Or ghouls, as they're calling them. I see a puddle and fire right next to each other, but I don't really know what I can do with that. Ooh. I can move these torches around to melt things. Okay. Well, just push this over here. And melt it! Good job, me. Although I s Oh, I can actually leap over these. Huh. Did not know that. Oh, hey, I found the exit. And what's up here? Past the exit. I am assuming stuff. Ooh, a chest. I got a vial. A vial of what? Just a vial? Replenishes 500 hit points. None of us have anywhere near that many hit points, so... A little overkill there, but better to have it than to not have it. All right, well, assuming I'm going the right way... There should be a lighthouse around here somewhere. Oh my goodness, it's a bear. We are in Canada. Nice to meet you. I am Xeno Slayer of Bears. You must be afraid of me, and you must have heard of me. For we kill bears with lightning, for we are reasonable people. Holy shit, the bear did not... Ivan, do not die to the bear. You wield the power of lightning. And plasma. I do not understand how you can lose to this mere creature. There we go. That was kind of scary, actually. <laughs> I thought we were going to lose for a second.
I think that's the lighthouse up there, and a village over here, which I really needed to go to. Lamil, I went the right way somehow. Hi, are you new in Lamil? No, I've been here forever, man. Oh, look familiar. Are you sure you're not fibbing? I should warn you, there's a bad cold going around right now. Really, I wonder why there's a cold going around. Try not to catch it. We've had a lot of strangers lately. Wonder if they're going to Mercury Lighthouse. We're going to the Mercury Lighthouse also. There's been an epidemic going around the mill. You should leave right away if you don't want to catch it. Mia is running around town caring for the sick. I just don't want to be any more trouble to her. Oh, that's sweet, whoever that is. And I got an empty bottle. Garrett, why the hell are you carrying so many empty bottles? Do you have a drinking issue? Extracts water from a magic spring. Oh, well, we needed this item to go get the spring water to give to the tree. Oh, help me. Grandpa, Grandpa. Oh no, this is terrible. Get Mia, please get Mia. I'll get her right away. After I check out everything else, like the inn and, you know, take my time. We're, we're the only inn that stays open in winter, since guests are so few. We'll wait on you hand and foot, so please stay a while. Winters are tough here, so I'm glad I have guests to talk to. I'm going to give them the best service I can. So many customers, it just goes to show you. Good things happen if you work hard. I wish that was true. Sure, I'll rest here. Even though I'm on urgent business to go get someone's daughter because their grandfather's in pain. I hope you slept well despite all the screaming next door from that old man. Do you want to see the restaurant menu? Yeah, food. Here you go. We're a small town, mind you, so the selection isn't great. We don't get to eat many fancy meals in the winter. A tasty stew would be a real treat. What is this guy doing? Is he just doing squats in the snow? One, two, three, four. I tend to stay indoors a lot when the weather turns cold. It's not good for your health though, so I try to work out. People get sick because they stay indoors all day hiding from the cold. You have to keep in shape if you don't want to get sick. Sir, I'm not quite sure that's how you prevent colds, but... Oh, slippery ice. Another graveyard? Zemo, Zeno examined the grave, but didn't find anything. Oh, found... I got a lucky medal that I stole off this grave. That's not cursed. I think I found the snow church. Have you visited the old couple who live near the entrance of town? Yeah, they're dying. Oh, that's too bad. That's where Mia was headed. You probably just missed her if you didn't see her along the way. I didn't mean to push you. Mia was saying that she has a bad feeling about something. Did she have met these people? Well, I don't need to go to the church right now. Uh, sir, are you okay? Sir? Mia should be here by now. Where is she? Rachu, I'm freezing. Is Mia here yet? I don't know. But hey, look, there's treasure I can get, I think. After I solve this puzzle. Which I assure you, I am only the best at. Hence why I'm failing the puzzle right now. I see a snowman up there. <laughs> Can't jump down there. Let's see, there's a weapon shop. Let's see if they have anything. No one's here. Oh, they're asleep. Are they sick? We're closed, sorry. I get a little cranky when I'm sick. I'll open up shop when I get better. Why do they always come when I'm sick? <laughs> do you want weapons? Yeah. I can't sell weapons until I'm cured. Oh, I'm getting chills. <laughs> what, what about that barrel of weapons right there? Can't I just have one? No, you can't. Fix me. I always love that when, like, you go to a shop in an RPG, and they have shit tons of weapons just all over the walls, in barrels, on the floor, on stands, and you go to their shop counter and they're like, Hi, we sell bronze daggers and bronze daggers only. Please ignore that axe of the Overlord Destroyer on the wall that is just for display. 
<laughs> the epidemic. I'm dying. Mia, save us. Her palms shine with the blue light. Could she be an angel? Um... Okay, whoever this Mia girl is, I don't think she's in town anywhere. I haven't seen her. And everyone's wondering where she is, so... I guess the best thing we can do right now is head to the lighthouse and hope we can find her. Because I can't get up to where that thing is right now, and that looks like an obvious dungeon hidden hole thing. What if I push the snowman? Get out of there, Frosty. Well, I don't know what good that did, but I pushed the snowman. So I go up, left, up, left, up, right, up, right, up, left. Uh, up, down, right, up. Oh no. I broke the cycle. Oh! I got into the ice hole. Oh, hey, there's a Ginny here. Let's save real quick before I start fighting this thing. Saving. Your game was saved. Why did you just turn this place into hell, little guy? Wait, just for free? I just get you for free? The Mars Ginny, Fever, has joined Garrett. Sick! So now we have Forge, Fever, Granite, Flint, and Breeze. And what does Fever grant you? Nothing we can use on the field. Oh well. I don't even know how I get up to that ladder. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Fix the problem myself. I got a vial, which I gave to Garrett again. Looks like the only place we can go is that lighthouse, so... It's our next stop. Whoa! I like the statues, I like the tile layout of this place. Is this a... Fountain of Healing. Water of Hermes. I hope I'm saying Hermes right, or Hermes or Erms or whatever it's supposed to be. It brings rejuvenation to all that lives. The fountain seems dry. Turn the water back on. For a second, I thought this was literally gonna be, hey, you wanna get the thing? Just walk over and take it out of the fountain. Nope, there has to be puzzles. <laughs> I really like the look of this place. Oh, I just jumped across. Strange forces are at work. It seems to be impossible to proceed. Nothing I can do with that from here. I don't know how I'm supposed to get that. Because my push doesn't go that far. I don't have anything else I can use. Oh, she's back! How are you feeling? <coughs> I think I'm dying. I think he'll be okay, dear. <laughs> He's been coughing for quite a while now. You'll feel better soon. Did that just say fly or pry? That is the ugliest goddamn fairy I've ever seen. <laughs> How do you feel now? Much better, thank you, cocaine fairy. No, Grandpa, you must push yourself too hard. Okay. <laughs> thank you, Mia. I can't imagine how this village would ever manage without you. <laughs> Don't mention it. You should rest too in bed, ma'am. That sentence was kind of messed up, but go to bed! <laughs> Who are you? Can I help you? What was that? The lighthouse? It can't be. Only I can. Oh no, Alex! 
Um, what was that about? Somebody is here. Yeah, yeah, we're right here. Someone is here. Can you hear it too? No. You can't hear it? Well, I can. Alex is the only other... Is the only one other than I who can enter the Mercury Lighthouse. But this statue is blocking my way. Odd, that wasn't there before. Oh, she wants us to help her. Push! Did you do that? Yep. I knew it. I saw a ghostly force pushing it. You... you could see our synergy? Synergy? Is that what you call that power? We had thought you were using synergy when you healed that old man, Mia. That's a special power handed down to members of the Mercury Clan. From generation to generation. It's called Ply, okay? It's actually called... It's not... It's not Fly. It's not Pry. It's not Fry either. It's Ply. A power generated through meditation. It was once much stronger. This Mercury Clan sounds a little like, peop uh, like people of Vale, don't you think? Yeah. Sure, they're sworn protectors of a special power, just like us. I have to go. I have to find wh whoever entered the lighthouse. Ply! Okay, legitimately, how does the name and the fairy and... What is your actual ability? Oh, she's like, no, oh, this way, no. Hmm. I love how the, this dumb wizard creature's just stepping back and forth like, no, no, uh, not this way, no, uh. A monster inside Mercury Lighthouse, how could this be? Don't worry, we'll just murder it. Like always, how I solve all of my problems in this game. Ramses, let's go. Oh, I can now summon Kieran, like from Monster Hunter. Whoa! It's a... I, that sprite was moving so fast, I couldn't even see what it was. There was like a guy riding something. Although, to be honest, I should probably have Garrett doing that to increase his fire. Oh, it was just a normal enemy. Never mind. Hey, wait! You're gonna die in here if you... What? Did she just go in a random direction? He who honors the heart of the goddess shall stand at the center of it all, like a swan in the center of a rippling pond. Lady, where did you go? Water temples, everyone's favorite in everything and anything. Oh, there you are. The path is blocked again. What am I going to do? How about look at me for five seconds? <sighs> Wait, what? How did... There. You better not just run past me and ditch me. Hey, listen, we can work together. You saved me again, haven't you? Do you have business in the lighthouse, too? Yeah. I thought so. I am sure that there will be more places ahead that I cannot pass alone. Only those of the Mercury Clan are permitted to enter this place. However, I sense something special about you. I feel that I can trust you. Mia joined your party. Now oh, come on, ghost friends. Told you we're not ghosts. <laughs> Something a ghost would say. All right, so we have Mia now. I didn't get a chance to check her stats out. But she seems to be another caster. Probably a healer. Just guessing. Because Ray's an offensive one. So we have Mia who has Fizz. Um, 
For synergy, oh wow, yeah, she's an ice mage who can also heal. She has ply, which is restore 100 HP with faith's power. She can also cure poison, thank goodness. And she has frost, tundra, and ice. I have a strong feeling ice attacks are not going to be the strongest against anything in this dungeon, but let's try it. Let's try ice. If we don't murder it first. Go, ice! Okay, how about we try Frost, if she can get around to it. Looks like Ivan's destroying today. And now a level 11 knight. Sick. So, now for Synergy, we have Frost. Which I will... No, I wanted to map it. Because I don't need to mind read anyone in here. Someone said at the end of this, they're going to make a compilation, or like... I don't know who it was, but someone said, like, you should make a compilation of you saying MIND READ <laughs> all throughout this, uh, LP. <laughs> and yes, that would be amazing. Although it would take forever for me to do it. What's going on here? Oh, a movement puzzle. Ah! Well, I'm not dead. <laughs> I'm glad the stream of water didn't just cut my character in half. More water here. Now we can go under here. And up here. And we can't get to that chest. Because of the way that the water's running. But that's fine. Now we can go under here and up here. And now we're stuck. Oh wait, no, I can move this back. And now I can go get that chest. I got a Psy Crystal. All these items, I feel like I keep getting all these items that I can't even identify. Replenishes all synergy points. That is pretty damn good. You hang on to that, Garrett, because for some reason, even though you're the slowest and you'll never get to use the items on time, I give all of my items to you, which probably is not the smartest thing to do. But the power of friendship will ensure that you can get to me in time before I die. Ivan, probably not. Wait, hold on a second. Are you serious? Does this girl have more HP than Ivan? Ivan, you need to lift some weights. This girl of unidentifiable age, I'm assuming around mine can lift more than you, boy. Let's try Tundra. If we get to it in time before all my characters murder this wizard thing. Tundra! You know, that looked a lot less threatening than the level one ice spell. Oh, a door. The door is tightly locked. Never mind. Guess we're not taking that path. I don't even know how I'm supposed to get up there. Oh, I can just go around. I'm so stupid. Just gotta walk around this way. Oh, what is this? It's a lady. It's a siren. Oh my goodness, and the witcher, those things are freaky. Hit her with a plasma bolt. Oh no! She made kissy faces at Ivan, and it dropped his guard. Ivan, you mustn't taint the faith. Don't give in to worldly pressures. Ivan's like, but I'm not religious, though. It's like, well, get on that. <laughs> okay, I see. So all I have to do is push this very heavy lady all the way to the button over there. Wait a second, that opens the door though. Don't, oh, okay, I guess that's my only option. I was thinking I could drop her down there in order to step across, but doesn't seem like it's gonna work. One, two, three, gotcha. Oh no, 
It's a Splatoon. Die, squid creature. May your civilization fall. Uh-oh. <laughs> and in here is a... I didn't expect my character to do that. He who honors the heart of the goddess shall stand at the center of it all. Like a swan in the center of a rippling pond. Using ice magic, I can... Do nothing. Using move, I can steal this... No, I can't. Oh. No, that's not gonna work either. Using frost magic, I can... Nope. Not doing it. What other synergies we got? We have Ply. No, that's just a healing spell. Nope, never mind. That fixed the puzzle. Whoa, what the... Oh, that's cool! It gives me, like, a bunch of steps so I can walk across the water. Okay. So if I step on this one, it gives me halos. So that way I can walk on water. And now there's a- oh my goodness, a mimic! I never thought I'd see that here. And it's a crab mimic chess thing. I don't really know how to deal with this situation. Guess just throw magic at it and hope it dies? Oh no, it debilitated us. Lowering our defenses. Man, this mimic's not weak. More magic! Mimic, can you go down, please? You're taking a lot of damage. Maybe if I just attack it? Let's try summoning Jupiter. Oh, wait, no, we already did that. I can't summon Mercury because it's equipped. Go, Fizz! Oh, it heals all of her HP. In that case, let's ply me. Oh, did it just throw sheep on Ivan? Oh no, don't fall asleep! Holy shit, Garrett with the axe. Garrett, you're my first axe unit, I donate. I'm just kidding, I love you, Nolan. Now Ivan's a wind seer- wait, no, he already was that, he's just a higher level one. I got Water of Life. Cool, how do I get out of here? Oh, huh. All the dungeons in this game are so cool. Like, I love them. Uh-oh. Give me the halos. Okay, but I still don't... Oh, wait. I can just... One, two, three. Step. One, two, three. Step. I have to plan this out really carefully. There's nothing over there. Okay, and I got across. And I got a sleep bomb! 
how useful that is? Don't know. And what's up in this corner? Is there actually anything over here? No? Okay. Hey, I made it across to... Whatever's over here. Just a pathway. But this pathway will... Lead me to where I think I need to go. And in this room is a random encounter. Oh, found a door. And this room has no water, which means I probably have to bring water to it using this pipe system. Because the true hero was the plumber all along. But now I'm more con- oh, I get it. I have to build the entire thing. So that goes up there. And this one goes over here. And that will give me water for the other room to... Pretend I am Jesus for like 10 seconds. One, two, three, jump. And a platform. No, this is not fair. Can't we just leave Garrett, please? I don't want to do the puzzle. So it looks like I have to get that ice lady through that slot in the floor. No problem. Easy as cake. Nix. No, if I push this down first... Will I be stuck? I might. I don't know. Hold on. Push this over here. Which means I have to push this down. And then after I've done that, I can push this one to the left. Redirecting the flow of water. But I still don't know how to get in there. Huh. Oh, I see. Because that... Oh, I get it. I have to redirect the water in order to move the statue around because I can't get in there. So, the idea is... Man, this one takes a lot of walking. I have to move around to over here. Push this over here so I can reset the puzzle. It's gonna push it down. And now, all I have to do is push it back to where it was. So I push this over here. I push this down. And got it. In the rabbit hole it goes. I have a feeling that there's gonna be a big scary monster behind there, so I need to save and heal. Okay, so move this once, twice, and open the door. I did it. Oh, I thought that was gonna be the end. Oh, not more of this. These rooms where I push these to the side and then there's a hidden room behind. There's gonna be two, isn't there? Nope, just one. I got a nut. Great. That'll help me for sure. Grab this, push it to the side. And we're through. Redirect some water. I don't holy shit that water is strong I am so glad I didn't really step into that at any point 
It looks like he would kill me. <laughs> oh, a new monster. A harpy and a siren. I really feel like they don't like electricity, so that's what we're going to hit them with. And everything else, too. No, no more sleep spells. Yeah, it's working, Garrett. Just keep on it. We could probably just slice our way through the rest. There we go. Okay, let's check every single one of these waterfalls for a fake entrance. Or a secret entrance. <gasps> I found another chin! Should have known he would attack. Alright. So, similar plan to before. It looks like this one's water, so it probably doesn't like electricity. I'm gonna really stop doing that. Probably doesn't like electricity too much. So... Our first turns, I'm gonna do this. Get rid of this one. Might not like fire, either. Uh, what does Fever do? Because Forge boosts our attack power. Fever wraps a foe in feverish delusion. Sure, we can try that. I have no idea what that actually means. But we can try it. Drench. Oh no, bubbles! Ow, that hurt like hell. Oh, he's... Delusion now. Is that, like, confused? Unsure. Cure myself. Get a flare wall. Or actually, no one said a flare wall. I want you to forge and give us all a boost. And... As for Ivan, just keep casting plasma. And you, I want you to heal Garrett. Well, I'm glad I got to heal before he got his turn, because I have no idea what Delusion actually does. Oh, he sees clearly once again. Still unsure as to what exactly that means, but I can use Granite to help protect all of us. And now we can summon Kieran again. Ivan, just keep casting Plasma. And you can cast Tundra. The Ginny system is really cool. I'm digging it. I really am. Let's dig it! Wait, it's dead already? I think I went a little overkill on the poor guy. Whatever, you're mine now. Like a Pokemon I... Ugh. Just drop water in my eyeballs. Sleet. Wait, Sleet's water. I want it with Fizz. Or, no, it's Fizz. What's her name? <laughs> I want it with Mia. So, Sleet. Effective unleashing in battle. Drench a foe to drop its attack. No secret doors here. Oh, found it. I just have to push that. Wow, this place goes on forever. Feels like I've just been walking down these hallways for a century. Whoa! <laughs> he who honors the goddess of rainbows shall receive a rave. Or I guess you'll go to heaven, whatever. Upon wings of fluid grace. But, what about your statue? Okay, I'm guessing that just means not frost. Wrong spell. I'm guessing this just means use the synergy on the rainbow again. Ply. You know, ply doesn't make a whole lot of sense to me. It's one of those weird ones where it's like, hey, if you use this, it'll be great.
Frost. So want me to use Ply here also? Oh, yep, wanted me to use on the statue. Okay, what exactly does this do? This is so ambiguous. It's just like every once in a while it'll solve a problem. Guys, are we going on the upside down water slide death trap? I, I guess we're just gonna do it. Okay, okay, we're going to heaven. I mean, it's like, do we have to go to heaven? Garrett's like, yeah, we're going to heaven right now. Oh man. <laughs> I wanted it to shoot into space like a rocket ship. So, I know this is super anticlimactic to do, and you guys are probably itching to see this boss, but I'm actually going to end this episode here. I'm having so much fun with this game. Um, I'm glad it was on the list of suggestions, and it is definitely not overhyped. It does do some things very differently from other RPGs. So I'm excited to play more next episode. If you liked it, please leave a like and comment about how much you like the series, because I don't know how people fear feel about this one right now. Um... Yeah, that's about it. See you guys in the next one. Riding out.